Well, everyone, iOS 27 is going to be one of those versions of software that's going to be coming out at some point. Now, we don't know, in fact, exactly what particular day when it's going to be coming out, but we can kind of get an idea of what Apple could end up bringing within iOS 27. Now, right now, there's been literally nothing. So there's been no leaks. It's all just my speculation. But I think with the way Apple's kind of going is that they're pretty much going to go ahead and do something crazy with Apple intelligence. I think within iOS 26, I think Apple's going to try to release a new version of Siri and do all that other crazy stuff. But it looks like to me, Apple is just is probably not going to get it right again. And they're probably going to end up going through and releasing iOS 27 with some really big focuses in on Apple intelligence. So that's going to be third time's the charm. I think there's going to be something like that there. And that's probably going to make the most amount of sense for Apple to do. So there's going to spend a bunch of time talking about iOS you know, 27's int Apple intelligence features. I think beyond that, they're not really going to go through as far as I can tell. I don't think they're going to change the UI again. So they're going to have to give us some really cool capability or some really cool feature to differentiate iOS 26 and iOS 27. And I always fall back on basically our iPhones getting split screen multitasking. Now there's been rumors of an iPhone fold kind of coming out. So I feel like if this iPhone fold ends up coming out or it ends up getting released at some point, Apple's going to have to go through and pretty much kind of focus in on creating some sort of a new experience for these iPhones. And I think split screen multitasking could be a thing and a feature for the iPhone folds, meaning Apple's going to have to present this feature inside of iOS 27. So that could end up being something too that could end up coming out. And I think there's going to be some other cool little tweaks and cool little features here and there. But as far as I can tell, I don't think there's going to be a massive UI change. I think there's going to be some more toggles that we can kind of maneuver around and stuff. But other than that, I think for the most part, those are some of the changes, some of the features. And the release date is basically going to be, you know, next September officially. And then June next year, we're going to start getting the betas. So if you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, soul man.